Hello, I'm Patrick Clem, a clinical pharmacy specialist with UC Health. In this video, we'll walk you through the role Belatacept, an immunosuppressant drug, plays in transplant. One of the biggest concerns post-transplant is the body rejecting the transplant organ. Rejection is caused by the body's immune system. To prevent this, you will need to take, for the rest of your life, multiple medications that inhibit your immune system. Belatacept may be one of those medications. Belatacept works by preventing your immune cells from becoming active. These immune cells are a type of white blood cell that can cause rejection. Belatacept is commonly administered in an outpatient infusion center via intravenous infusion over 30 minutes. Dosing of Belatacept is initially every two weeks, then every 28 days. Some side effects of immunosuppressant medications include increased risk for infection and certain cancers. Possible side effects of Belatacept include infusion site swelling or pain and anemia. Belatacept can interact with other medications, so you'll need to make sure your transplant team is aware of all medications, including prescription and over-the-counter that you may be taking. In closing, Please remember that taking your medications correctly and consistently is one of the most important things you can do to help prevent rejection. As always, we're here to answer any questions you may have. To learn more, visit uchealth.org transplant.